New Planet Once upon a time, there was a boy named Kevin who lived on a farm. He loved to help his parents to grow tomatoes and cucumbers, as well as playing with farm animals. He lived a very happy life of a small boy. Besides, Kevin had always been fascinated by the stars and loved to stargaze every night. He had a telescope on the roof of their farmhouse and adored spending cozy summer evenings looking into the unknown. One day, Kevin discovered a strange shooting star that landed in the nearby forest. Without wasting any time, Kevin ran towards the direction of the shooting star, eager to see what it was. As Kevin reached the spot, he found a small spaceship that had landed on Earth. To his surprise, he saw a small alien walking out of the spaceship. The alien introduced himself as Zog, and he was on a mission to find a new home for his people, as their planet was in danger. Kevin offered to help Zog in his mission, and together they set out on a journey to find a new planet for Zog's kind. The technology that the spaceship used allowed traveling between planets in minutes. It was very convenient as the boy wanted to be at home in the morning because otherwise his parents would start to worry. Kevin and Zog traveled far and wide, but they couldn't find a suitable planet. They finally stumbled upon a strange and beautiful planet that was inhabited by pink pyramidal creatures. Kevin was in awe of the stunning planet and the kind creatures that lived there. As Kevin and Zog explored the planet, they were amazed by the sights they saw. The planet was covered in lush green forests and had towering mountains that reached for the sky. There were rivers and lakes dotted all over the landscape, and a rainbow of colorful flowers bloomed everywhere. They also noticed that the air was fresher and the sky was brighter than they had ever seen before. Kevin and Zog then encountered other types of inhabitants. They saw creatures with multiple arms and legs, others with large wings and some that could change color at will. But all the creatures were friendly and welcomed the two explorers with open arms. The creatures lived in harmony and peace, and it was evident that they lived their lives with love and kindness. Kevin and Zog were welcomed into the community and were able to learn about the customs and traditions of the creatures. The boy soon realized that this was the perfect planet for Zog's kind. Even though Zog and his people were small, they would be safe here, as the planet was very friendly to anyone. Zog thanked Kevin for all his help and, before leaving, gifted him a magical crystal that would grant him one wish— that crystal could only be gifted to someone who provided a significant help to Zog's civilization, and so Zog gladly handed it to Kevin. Kevin wished to visit the magical planet whenever he wanted, and with the help of the crystal, he was able to come back as many times as he desired. At first, the boy was scared to tell anything to his parents. He did not want to be punished for running alone in the forest at night, not to mention meeting aliens on other planets. But then, he decided to show the crystal to his parents, thinking that the beauty of this magical object would explain everything better than words. He was right. The parents gladly listened to his story, and going forward, they all became friends with the alien creatures and had many exciting adventures on the planet together.